my boilers and welcome to our read aloud. So this is our listening and learning time because we are listening and then we are going to learn a bunch. So right here I have a picture of, what is this? What do I have a picture of today? It's a pig. So a lot of times you're going to notice in nursery rhymes, the main characters, remember the main character is who the story or nursery rhyme is about. So a lot of times in nursery rhymes, the main character is going to be an animal. So yesterday we saw that one of the main characters was a spider in Little Miss Muffet. So today's story is going to be all about pigs. It's going to be all about pigs. So while I'm reading, your job is to identify. That means your job is to find and name all of the main characters and what they are doing. So the, what they're doing is the main events. So that's what they are doing, the most important things that they are doing. So our nursery room today is called This Little Pig Went to the Market. So if I look at it, here we go. We're going to start. This little pig went to the market. This little pig stayed home. This little pig had roast beef. And this little pig had none. And this little pig cried wee 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 all the way home. So this pig went to the market. So a market is a place where you can buy and sell things. So it might be like a store, it might be outside. It's just where people can buy or sell things. That is a market. So this little pig had roast beef. So roast beef is a type of meat. So it's a type of meat. So what we're gonna do is you are going to read after me or repeat after me. So when I point to me, it's my turn. When I point to the camera, it is your turn. You're gonna say it with me. Here we go. So it's my turn. This little pig went to the market. This little pig stayed home. This little pig had roast beef. And this little pig had none. And this little pig cried wee 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 all the way home. Good job guys, you're getting so good at this. All right, so a couple of questions that I wanna ask you is, how many pigs does this nursery rhyme talk about? How many pigs? There are, let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. There are five little pigs. Five little pigs that we are talking about in this nursery rhyme. So what does each of the pigs do? What are the main events? Remember, that was your job, was to find out how or what the main characters are and what they do, what's the main event. So we can say one went to a market, one went home, one ate some food or ate roast beef, one didn't eat anything at all, and one was crying and ran home. So those were the main events. So the pig that cried wee 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 all the way home, how do you think he feels? How do you think that little pig feels? Probably sad, maybe they're frightened. Frightened, remember, was a big word that we learned yesterday. It means that they are scared. So those are all reasons why he could be crying and running home, because he's scared, he's sad, all things like that. So we have to think about the feelings of these guys. So, awesome job with our read aloud today. So keep up the super good work, and we will get another read aloud tomorrow.